Hi, welcome to our series on best of cat. This is Amit Panchmatya with the next question on arithmetic. As usual, if you have, uh, I would expect you to try and solve the question, pause the video over here and only then look at the solution. Now, if you look at this question, we see that they have told us a person has invested 15 lakh rupees out of which he has invested a part of it at 6%. And the remaining part, he has broken it in the ratio 2 is to 1 and invested at 4% and 3%. The total interest he earns is 76,000 rupees. Question asked is, what was the amount invested at 6%? So let's start with this much and let's try and understand the question. So what have the, if I say, let the amount invested at 6%, which I want to find be x. And the remaining amount, if I take it as 3y. Now, why have I taken it as 3y? So, it becomes easy for me to break it up in the ratio 2 is to 1. Right? So, which means there will be 2y invested at 4% and y invested at 3%. I will get one equation from here. So, let's see. 6% of x will become 6 upon 100 into x plus 4% of 2y, that is 4 upon 100 into 2y plus 3% of y is equal to 76,000. If you want, you can write also, you can write that as 0 0.76 lakhs because 15 lakhs has the first equation as 15 lakhs. I think it will be easier. So, we will have 6x plus 8y plus 3y which is 11y is equal to 0 0.76 into 100 which becomes 76 lakhs. And our first equation had to be x plus 3y is equal to 15 lakhs. So, I've got two equations. I want to find x. So, learn directly to eliminate y. Multiply this equation with 3 and this equation with 11 and subtract them. What will we get? We'll get 18x plus 33y is 228. And the second equation will be 11x plus 33y is equal to 165. If I subtract both the equations, what do I get? I get 7x is equal to 63. Therefore, x is equal to 9 and that is what we want to find. Now, understand the answer was 9 lakhs, right? Read the question very carefully. They have said in lakhs, which means in a theta question, you input only 9 and not 9 lakhs. Now, this is a very common mistake a lot of students can make that they would input the whole 9 lakh with all the zeros. You had to input only 9 in the answer. Please be careful about that. For the same question, now I'm going to try and use a different approach for this. Pay attention carefully. A person has invested a total amount of 15 lakhs, right? Now, they, we know that he has invested some per amount at 6% and the remaining amount he has broken up into the ratio 2 is to 1, which he has invested at 4 and 3%. So, what you should be able to do first that you should be able to do this part of the calculation, the rough work or orally. He has invested two parts at 4% and one part at 3%. Divide that by three parts, making it 11 by 3% as an average rate. So, that would be 3.67 or whatever, but just leave it as 11 by 3%. Now, let's understand how could you do. Now, can I say I have just got two parts? He has invested some amount at 6% and some other amount at 11 by 3%. So, can I use allegations? We're going to make use of allegations a lot of, in a lot of questions. So, pay attention carefully. Suppose he has invested everything at 6%. So, how much is 6% of 15 lakhs? And I'm going to do everything in lakhs since the answer asked also is in lakhs. So, what is 6% of 15 lakhs? So, you can do 15, 6 is 90, 90 divided by 100 would be 0 0.9 lakhs. That means if he was, if he had invested everything in terms of only 6%, he would have earned a total interest of 0 0.9 lakhs. Similarly, if he had invested everything at 11 by 3%, so that would be 11 by 300 of 15 lakhs, that will become 15 ones are 15 twenties are, that will become 11 by 20, 11 by two, uh, two is no 5.5, 5.5 divided by 10 will become 0 0.55 lakhs. Or if you want to write in thousands, this will be 90,000, 55,000, while your average was 76,000. 
using allegations i get 14000 over here 76 minus 55 becomes uh, 21000 so the amount i know has to be in this ratio this ratio can be reduced to 3 is to 2 i want to find the first part so the amount invested at 6% will become 3 by 5 of 15 lakhs and the answer would be 9 lakhs. Pretty, pretty straightforward method. Definitely the preferred method. You should be practicing enough with the second method to understand such questions. And we are also giving you one practice question which we will answer in the comments later.